What's up? This is the BIOS. I'm doing this video for someone who needs some help here. So, we're in the main BIOS utility. We're going to go to the IA tweaker. This is usually on auto. You want to flip it on to manual. And then you're going to want to flip this to the i7-87. Blah, blah, blah. And then this is going to say 21. You want to use the arrow key. Arrow, or I mean plus key. Sorry, my bad. You're going to make it a 22. You're going to go down, make sure that's disabled. You're going to want to bump this up to 150. I actually got it hotter. I got it to 3.3 to megahertz. Or sorry, 3.3 gigahertz. And it's even overclocking the RAM. But in the uh, task manager, it doesn't show that it's overclocked. It still says 1333. So yeah, that's all you really got to do. Oh, also what I did. Where was it? Hardware monitor. Yeah, I went to the hardware monitor. And I flipped this to enable. And I turned this to 100%. But yeah, I just copy all this stuff enabled. And I switch this to turbo. I'm going to go back. So I'm just actually going to go through everything. So that way you can match up everything the same. So just make sure all this stuff here is the same. That max CPU limit is disabled. The virtual the virtualization stuff's disabled. The C1 E support's disabled. You want the hardware prefetch enabled. The adjacent cache line prefetch enabled. Let me get back out of there. And I think that's really the only other ones that would matter. Yeah, this you want that to be enabled. The Unicore configurations, onboard devices should be simple. Yeah, make sure that that Marvel storage controller is on AHCI mode. Uh, make sure that this is disabled. Make sure this is enabled. Uh, plug and play stuff. I have it no for some reason. Power. Make sure all this power stuff looks like this. This, I usually like to have power off if the AC is lost. I didn't notice that last time. So I don't want it trying to start back up if there's going to be a thunderstorm and the power is going to keep coming on and off, on and off, on and off. So yeah, everything should be the same. And exit and save. Yeah. So it's going to do its configurations. Boop boop be doo. Man, I got this weird glare. I got a waterproof case and it's making everything glare funny. But yeah, I also added a fan. I don't know if we're gonna be able to see. My kid likes to live in the dark. So I like zip tied a fan right here. So it's blowing all the hot air out. And I flipped the back fan here because it's pushing air out. It's causing like a vortex inside so it wasn't really pulling air property, properly. So I made it so this is sucking air inside and this is pushing hot air outside. And the temperatures with the new clock that I have it at, it was at 71 max. Let me see here. Performance. So yeah, it's only showing. Oh yeah, it's showing 3.29 gigahertz. And the memory should still be at 133.3. But yeah, what is with the focus going on here? My case must be that dirty. My solid state Kingston, 240 gig. 
Yeah, boys. That's how it's done. Peace.